This week's feast, Coco! What's up, everybody? Today I am joined by two very special guests. We have AJ Raphael, an amazing YouTuber and musician, and of course, Anthony Gonzalez, the voice of Miguel and Coco. Ooh, hello! <laughs> I hope everyone's seen this movie at this point. It, I cried a lot. Did you cry when you watched it? Yes, I cried. Oh my gosh, <laughs> tears. <laughs> yeah, tears. I've watched it nine times and I've cried all nine. Nine <laughs> times? Holy crap. I'd ball thinking about it. <laughs> we played one of the songs earlier and I looked over and you were just like slowly <laughs> laughing. <laughs> <laughs> Normally, we make foods from the movies, but Coco didn't have as much food in it, so we decided to do something that was much more culturally relevant. We all know what champurrado is? Yes. Yeah. Every time like I go to a party, there's always champurrado, like Christmas party. Uh, okay. Yeah, I just love drinking this. Yes. Yeah, it's like it warms you up in the wintertime. Yes. And AJ, you too, right? Yeah, actually in Filipino culture as well, we eat champurrado for breakfast. For breakfast? Yeah. 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 Wow. Like right on Saturday, Saturday mornings. Yeah. Oh, doing that. <laughs> <laughs> but the recipe is super simple and it warms the heart and it's delicious, so let's get right to it. Champurrado in Mexican culture is a chocolate-based atoli, warm and thick. So to make it as genuine as possible, we'll be using ingredients like the star anise and piloncillo, an unrefined whole cane sugar. This is the real deal for brown sugar with zero processing. And Ibarra chocolate, a versatile cooking chocolate that's used in mole sauce, but is also perfect for melting and turning into a hot champurrado. Finally, we'll use masa harina flour, a traditional flour for tortillas, tamales, and to help thicken the drink like the one we're making today for that awesome consistency. Heat the pot at medium-high and add in three cups of water. Wait until the water begins to bubble and boil before adding in two sticks of cinnamon and a single anise star. At this point, cover the lid, remove your pot from the heat, and let everything steep for an hour. Afterwards, remove the cinnamon sticks and the star anise and return the pot to a low heat. Slowly add in your masa harina flour while stirring until combined. Then whisk in your chocolate, milk, making sure everything is fully melted. Increase the heat to medium until it's almost a boil, reduce the heat, and then continue to stir to dissolve the sugar and the chocolate. Voila, that's all there is to it. So serve this immediately, piping hot to your next best friend. Cheers. 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 Yes. Cheers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> this is like the best I've, this is the best I've ever tried. Wait, really? Oh my gosh. Yes. Wow. Really? That's it a was bold a, statement. It's a bold statement. I How's your chopper? It. <laughs> it's great. It's just like home. <laughs> just like home. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you know what? Full disclosure, we do have to say this. AJ, what are you drinking right now? Okay, okay, I'm drinking water. I'm what? actually allergic to dairy. <laughs> 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 uh, this happened later in life after I turned 18, so I have had champurrado before, just not lately. <laughs> it's not lately. So you really miss it. I do. Do you want to smell it? I mean, it? seeing you guys, can I smell this? <laughs> yeah, smell yeah. it. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so sad. <laughs> this entire time we're like, ooh, yummy, and looking yeah. over there, like, oh no, what they just doing over there. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Appreciate it. Well, the nice thing is, it's still winter time, so you can make this. It took like an hour about because you have to let the stuff steep, but it's delicious. It makes you warm on the inside. Gosh, I do love a good sugary drink. Yeah. <laughs> make it for a loved one. Make it for your family. I think I think some food that brings family together is something that all of our cultures share, and that's what makes me happy at the end of the day. Yes. Okay. Favorite Filipino food is this soup called sinigang. It's like a sour broth, oh. usually made with pork. And then there's chicken adobo. Oh, it's adobo different from it. other adobo, but it's really good. Have you had Filipino food before? No, I haven't. What? Ooh, I'm looking forward to some. trying it. Yeah. Okay, I'll bring you some next time. Thanks. Yeah, exactly. that is, that's definitely a Filipino culture thing. Yeah, bring yes. you some leftovers. Oh, for sure, for sure. <laughs> uh, Mexican food, I love like tamales and oh, yeah. pupusas and tacos, everything. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yes, everything like that, like uh, Central American, Latinos. Yes, I, I grew up with that eating like huevos and Oh my gosh, picoles. I'm so jealous. <laughs> Yeah. That sounds amazing. It's uh, a good life. And, and you know, yeah. like, I also love, like, pizza. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite Chinese food is probably, there's, like, a tomato dish that's, like, turned into, like, a broth you put on rice. Wait, we all eat rice, though, right? Yeah. Yeah, I love rice. Love, love, love rice. rice. That's the thing that binds us all together. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Asians, Mexicans, <laughs> Every culture. Yeah, actually, every culture in the world, I think, has rice. <laughs> I'd say so. How are you uh, Andy, thank you so much for joining us today on the you. show. And hey, look, if you guys have not seen Coco, it's actually not too late because you can get it on digital right now. You can download it and watch it right now. Or on the 27th, go to a store, buy a Blu-ray, buy a DVD. Yep. Do whatever you want. 
but make sure you see this movie. You are so amazing in it. Thank you. When I found, when I, when I was like, oh my god, who voiced this character? And I looked you up, I was like, what? <laughs> Have you been doing this for a while? Um, yeah, I've been acting since I was four. Wow. Oh my goodness. Wow. Yeah. Amazing. A lot of voice acting too, or acting? Um, acting? actually, I was usually just doing, like, acting, but, like, never voice acting, but... To be in a Disney Pixar movie is amazing. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's a dream you were come great. true. Yes. You were great. Thank you. Seriously, congrats on everything. Thank yeah. you. And cheers. Cheers, cheers. to Coco. And yeah. to you, AJ. Well, thank, thank you. you. <laughs> from the sink. Thanks so much, everybody. We'll see you next time.